Rabies is a deadly viral disease that affects mammals including dogs and humans. It is primarily transmitted through the saliva of infected animals most commonly through bites. Rabies vaccination for dogs is highly effective. The vaccine stimulates the dog's immune system to produce antibodies against the rabies virus. When the dog is exposed to the virus these antibodies neutralize it by preventing the disease from developing. In most cases the vaccine provides long-lasting protection. Rabies vaccines typically provide immunity for one to three years, depending on the vaccine type and the dog's age and health. In rare cases vaccinated dogs can still contract rabies, but these cases are extremely uncommon. Both vaccinated and unvaccinated pets that bite a person must be quarantined for 10 days. If the dog was infectious at the time of the bite, the signs of rabies in the animal will usually appear within 10 days. Breakthrough infections may occur due to various factors, such as vaccine failure or improper storage. Booster shots are also necessary to maintain immunity. When dogs receive regular boosters the chances of a vaccinated dog getting rabies remain exceptionally low. A well-timed booster can rapidly enhance the dog's immunity against rabies by reducing any potential risks further. In areas where rabies is prevalent in the wild animal population, the risk of exposure is higher. In such regions it's essential to maintain strict vaccination protocols. The chances of a vaccinated dog getting rabies can be affected by the dog's behavior and supervision. Dogs that are frequently outdoors and have more interaction with wild animals may face a higher risk. If your pet is bitten you should wash the bite wounds with soap and water as soon as possible. Proper supervision and avoiding contact with potentially rabies animals can help to reduce the chance of rabies in your dog. So by ensuring that dogs receive proper vaccination and booster shots, and by practicing responsible pet ownership, you can significantly reduce the risk of rabies in your dogs.